I'll tell you, Danica Packer's got a strong race car. He's going to take this thing to the lead. Yeah, she has the best shot at winning this race right now. Another lead change, as you saw, Elliot Sadler with the help of Tony Stewart. On board with Danica, she's running third. 31 lead changes, four away from the record with five and a half laps to go. Yeah, it's gonna be a matter, does she have the patience to hang there for a minute and, and let things kind of play out because they really don't want to make this move right at this point in time. She's gonna try the high side with Al Marola. Outside of my power, outside of him. <laughs> She's spotting for herself. <laughs> yeah, she got those two separated. They're going to get a huge lead right here. And they're going to get the push, and they're going to move no into run. the lead. Now, listen to the crowd. Down no the back straightaway. Almarola giving her the Barbara push. Angle. Look at the gap. Next time by four laps remaining, but here comes KHI. She's going to lead another lap. Lap number 13. Look at the fans. Yeah, I'm not sure it wasn't a plan for oh, Elliott Sadler and Tony Stewart to drop back. I think they want to be coming forward here. They're closing the gap. Here they come. Sadler takes them down low. Tony stays right on his bumper. He got a little separation now with the 7 and 88. Yeah, that could have been a little soon on Elliott's part, too. We'll have to see. Down the back straightaway. Elliott Sadler. Here comes Danica Patrick and Eric Amarola. 72 races in the Nationwide Series. Since Sadler has won, he is the only one in the top four in the points that has not scored a win yet this year. Got to do some serious blocking if he's going to win this race from Danica Patrick, though. They get past Danica Patrick. And they lost contact again, and they are getting passed by about four cars. Next time by, it'll be the white flag lap. 62 and 66 have a head of steam coming to the white flag here. This could be the best finish RWI has had. Here comes the white flag. Now they got to run. Yeah, they're going to separate those two right there. One lap to go, down on the low side, it's a net with Stephen Wallace pushing. Neither one of them has ever won a nationwide oh. race. Look out, Danica brushes the wall, they gather it back up. Sadler in trouble now as they broke apart. He and the nine of Tony Stewart. Logano and Kyle Busch to the lead. On the high side and all of a sudden the Annette combination breaks apart. Here comes Reed Sorson and he could win the $100,000 bonus in the nationwide dash for cash. Coming out of turn number four, it looks like Joey Logano has been so good at pushing, may end up winning. Uh oh, oh crash in the back. At the strike, the win goes to Logano and look at the carnage behind. behind. We have got one car on fly, fire. There's what's left of McMurray. So that was a big, big, hard crash. See parts laying everywhere. Mike Wallace got the winning it down. Two races in a row for him to get crashed on the very last lap. Oh, Murray, restrictor same plate. thing. Almarola was the car that was on fire. He gets out okay. There's Stephen Wallace, and he looks to be okay. Well, that's all. That's just the last lap of a race. You can see Mike Wallace kind of got separated. He tried to block and pick up a little bit of air. He and Danica got together, and then that just created a big mess. I hate seeing that many good race cars get torn up right at the finish. Heartbreak. Hold on. What's here now? Cut outside here, outside. Surprised the camera held on. Here's Danica's view. Those are the flames from Eric Almarola's car in front of her.